As you can see guys, there's 15 gigabytes of free storage on my Android device. You can do this for any device, even if it's an iPhone. All you need to do is watch the steps and I'll show you how to get these storage for free and have empty storage on your device. I hope you guys enjoy, stay tuned. Hey guys, I hope you're all doing well. So in today's video, like I said, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to get free unlimited storage on any Android device. It's very easy. So if you think this video is interesting, make sure to like it. And if you feel like this channel is worth subscribing to, don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bell. And by the way, guys, if you're an iOS user, make sure to watch till the end. I have a surprise for iPhone users as well. So with that being said, let's head into the tutorial. So the first thing you need to do is go to the Play Store and search for an application called Google Photos. Many Android phones come installed with this app so if you already have it just make sure to update it if not just go to the play store and search for google photos if you don't have play store or if you don't know how to use it i will have the link for you in the description but all you need to do is go to the play store and search for google photos so i already have it installed it's actually pre-installed on my phone so i'm just gonna uninstall it for the sake of explaining this tutorial step by step and like i said all the instructions and steps are shown to you in the right hand side of the screen so i'm gonna uninstall the application I'm gonna press on update and I'm gonna wait for the app to be updated so it's gonna take around two or three minutes so while we're waiting for this app to be installed I want to tell you guys if you comment on the video and like the video as well you have a chance of having your comment shown on my next video so these are the eight comments that I showed on my previous video and I will show it on this video as well if you want to have your comment shown in the next video just all you need to do is comment on this video and like it and you will have a chance of winning a comment to be shown on the next video because every video I show around 8 to 10 comments so with that being said the application is just about to be installed it's actually done so I'm just gonna give it a few seconds and I'll show you what you need to do step by step so let's wait for the application to be installed so the app is installed now, all you need to do is tap on open and you're going to wait for the app to be open now. After it's opened, you will be shown with a prompt, just tap on allow and then tap on turn on backup. So before you do that, you have an option to choose the Google accounts that are already logged into your phone and you also have the option to add another account by either creating an account or just signing in to a new account that you already have. No matter what option you choose, it works the same way. But I suggest that you sign into an account that you usually do for everything. If not, just create a new account. It shouldn't take more than five minutes. So with that being said, just try to use the account that you want. Tap on turn on backup and then you will be shown with the screen that I showed you in the beginning of the video. You have two options. The first one is high quality free unlimited storage and the second one is original. Choose the first one which is high quality free unlimited storage and I'll show you what you need to do. So after that just tap on confirm and then tap on next. And after that all you need to do is tap on next again. And after that you will be shown with a few slides. Just tap on next and I'll show you what you need to do. So this application gives you free unlimited storage like I said, as you can see it says getting your photos. Now this searches for all your photos and videos in your phone and it will automatically back it all up to this application and once they're all backed up you will be able to free up the storage that it had taken from your phone. So as you can see it says backing up and if you don't understand just give it a few seconds I'll explain everything for you step by step. So I already have another phone that I've already installed this app on and I'll show you how this will give you free unlimited storage. So this is my day to day phone. I use this practically every day and it has around 12 to 15 gigabytes of storage taken just from photos and videos. So if I open the app, because I have everything already backed up, so let me just turn on the Wi-Fi. All of the photos and videos from this phone is backed up to my account. So I think I have one picture left. I, I took a screenshot and it hasn't been backed up because it has to open the app to back up the photos and videos that you have in your phone. So it says backing up. And if you tap on free up 9.31, that means how many photos and videos of gigabytes that you have. But it can be different on different phones because different phones have different photos and videos. So if you tap on free up space, it will free up all the photos and videos that are originally on your phone as long as they're backed up to this application. 
if you don't know what I mean, this will take all the photos and videos to this application, store them there, and then when you press on free up space, it will delete it from your phone, but you will still have them. You will still have the original quality and the high quality pictures and videos in this application left. So make sure to choose free unlimited high quality. That's why I insisted on you to choose that option. Because when you do that, you will have unlimited storage. No matter how many photos and videos you have, you will automatically have them stored in this application without taking any storage from your phone. Okay, so that's it. And by the way, if you have any issues or comments, just make sure to comment below and I'll try to help you out. You can also post or upload pictures and videos from your computer to the same account by going to googlephotos.com on your browser and I'll show you what you need to do. So just go to googlephotos.com on your browser and you will have an option to upload photos and videos from there. So as you can see it will take you to the application but once you're in the browser of your computer it will just load up the page and then you'll be able to either view your photos and videos or just to upload random files or photos from your computer. So that being said, I'm gonna take this phone away and I'll show you on the phone that I just installed the application on what you need to do. So this is the upload tab that I was talking about, but more on that on a different video. So let's go and explain how the procedure of this works. So like I said, this will automatically upload anything from ranging from photos to videos from your phone to the application. And as you can see, it says now freeing up space so what this does this will automatically delete everything from your phone from your internal storage as long as it's in the google photos app so as you can see this one is backing up around 115 items so there's around 115 15 photos and videos in this phone it will back them up to this application and once they are done you will have the option that said free up space once you tap on that it will delete it from your phone but still have the high quality storage on your google photos application and if you're an iphone user like i said in the beginning of the video make sure to watch this video that i made a couple of months ago and it will show you how to do the same procedures on ios devices so if you're an ios or an iphone user even an ipad user make sure to watch this video here shown to you on the right hand side of the screen and you will be able to get unlimited free storage on your ios device as well so that's about it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed thank you so much for watching don't forget to leave a subscribe on this channel